Savior of the nations, come. Virgin Son, here make thy home. Marvel now, O heaven and earth, that the Lord chose such a birth. His words are the first verse to this week's Mater Dei Hymn of the Week, Savior of the Nations, Come. And this is another hymn which, like several others that we've looked at, is actually a translation of a paraphrasing of a very ancient chant hymn. The original hymn was written uh, by St. Ambrose, who had been made Bishop of Milan in 374, and the hymn was called Veni Redemptor Gentium. St. Ambrose was a doctor of the church, and he certainly had some involvement with music. He wrote several hymns. Uh, among them, he's credited with having composed the Te Deum, which is the church's universal hymn of praise. The origins of the hymn tune to which we sing this piece are actually slightly different. The hymn tune, which is called Nun kam der Heiden Heiland, is obviously German in origin, and in fact was written in 1524 by Martin Luther. Now this hymn tune itself uh, became very popular among German composers, especially with uh, J.S. Bach, who used it, I, I believe, I, I want to say six or seven times in his compositions. Uh, he even chose this particular hymn uh, to write the opening chorale in his Orgelbuchlein, which is his uh, little organ book of chorale settings. that we see uh, some Lutheran origins with this particular hymn tune, there can really be no doubt about the fact that this is a solidly Catholic hymn with its roots going back to a doctor of the church, St. Ambrose. We hope you'll add your voice to ours as we sing Savior of the Nations Come for our opening hymn this Sunday, the third Sunday of Advent, also known as Gaudete Sunday, which is traditionally treated as uh, somewhat of a little break in the otherwise penitential and preparatory season of Advent. Sunday High Mass, 10 a.m., I'll see you there. God bless you.